What's going on guys and welcome back to episode 41 of my Taskman series. So yeah, I'm back once again. I know I've said that a few times now, but I am back for a while and yeah, I do like playing this account in surges. So yeah, let's have another go of it and get some more of these tasks complete. So from the last episode, I've had a few comments about um, one of the insects tasks which I ticked off the many fat honeybee when in fact I should have got the many fat honeybee in amber. So yeah, before we start this episode, let's go off to the workers district, mine some rocks I think it is, and get this insect. While mining in the uh, workers district, we did get a crondite gem. So let's quickly check that. That should be added to our journal now. Ah, uh, where is it? There it is, the Crondite. So that is actually a task complete. So let's make our way to the spreadsheet. Uh, task. Oh, look, two new beginners. But yeah, let's go easy. Uh, what should we search? Gem, maybe? Gem. Find a unique gem or insect for Menifos Journal while mining, which is the Crondite. So yeah, let's quickly complete that. And yeah, that is task complete. So let's carry on mining and hopefully we can get this insect. There we have the honey fight, honey fight, mix both the words together, the menifite honeybee in amber there. Let's quickly check that. And I will show you our journal. And as you can see, yeah, so that is that task actually completed. And I think that next one would be in the medium. But yeah, that is task complete now. So, oh look, lovely little, where's the bot farm gone? Yeah, lovely little bot farm. But yeah, let's make our way back to the spreadsheet to show you what's going on to start this episode. So yeah, we've got two more beginner tasks, as you can see, and we're starting off 51% in the easy here. And this is what I've been looking forward to checking on the leaderboards where I actually am, because I can't remember in the last episode where we ended off. But yeah, let's go check it now. Uh, where am I? Oh, I'm not going to be on the leaderboards because I haven't completed a task in a while. Next. Uh, yeah, that's looking like the case. All right, cool. So we I'll show you that next one once we complete this task here, which is a unique in Asgarnia and I still can't say that word. Misfilling section of your collection log. And we need to get Okay, so yeah, let's go on the Defender Grinds and I'll meet you back at the Warriors Guild. There we go. Nice and quick. The Bronze Defender on six kills. So yeah, let's quickly get out of here and check our collection log. There we go. As you can see, the Bronze Defender is now complete. So yeah, let's make our way back to the spreadsheet. We got that on six kills, I said. The bronze defender. Oh, you can't actually see that. But yeah, bronze defender. And let's complete our task. There we go. So up to 52% now. Let's check the leaderboard to see where we are. Where am I? Am I? Number 90. Hmm. Uh, I don't know what our goal is for this episode. But yeah. Let's quickly go get our new task. Which is... Claim the archaeology experience from the books in the Dungeon of Disorder. There are three books found by searching bookcases. Uh, I don't know if that's a quest or not, but yeah, let's quickly go get some XP now. So we're at the right spot now. So let's search all these bookcases. And that's one of the books. Let's search this one here as well. Nope, nothing in that one nothing in that one so it should be in this one here there we go that is the second book over here is the next one so let's go quickly run over here and search these bookcases which one do we think not too close that one there hopefully i'm right nope this one here nope watch it be the one closest no wait Am I missing bookcase? Yeah. The third one is the cultist chores, right? And can be found by the disc dungeon, the spree's. Uh, 
Am I missing something here? Unless it's an actual... Alright, let's search all of these again quickly. Nothing. Nothing. Alright, cool. So let me quickly search this up. Uh, I can't f seem to find anything on that. Maybe I've uh, accidentally picked up before, but I don't see why when I literally just uncovered these. I don't know why I would have come in this error, but... Yeah, if there is a way to find out if I've actually had it, just leave it in the comments for me and I'll quickly read through them. Read through them. But yeah, let's quickly use these books. Free XP. And the second one. Another 500 XP. So nothing pops up. So let's quickly search this again after we've used these books. Nothing. Hmm, that's actually... It's quite annoying me that I can't find out if I've had it or not. Let me quickly uh, click on the task. Nothing there. Maybe on the wiki. Claim the archaeology experience from the books in the Dungeon of Disorder. So that's where we are now. There are three books found by searching bookcases around the dungeon. Two are called Amor Dente Malum Inferno, which we used and can be found the third one is at the Cultist Chores Rotar and can be found by the Dis Dungeon the pre spot, which is them. But I don't see no book and it's not in none of the bookcases. So yeah, um if there is a way to find out about that, just leave it in the comments and I'll go back in the next episode. So yeah, I'm gonna say that's task complete for now. So let's make our way to the spreadsheet once again complete our task and what do we get next claim a free clue scroll from Zadar. all right cool let's make our way to the grand exchange we're at Zadar now so let's quickly claim our we just talk to her don't we claim our uh, clue scroll um treasure chows where can i get my own clue scrolls what one do we want? Let's take a... Hmm, let's take a medium clue. Oh no, wait. Is that not you do it? Am I being stupid here? Um, open shop. Clue scrolls. Yeah, no. I think I'm being silly here. Today we found just south of Grand Exchange. If you somehow manage to collect enough elite kushas already that she won't offer another one to you, you are not allowed to complete one downgraded instead by using a crew. And what? Really? Tell me more about treasure trials. I'm sure there's she just offers you one though. Where did clue scrolls originate? Mate, this was supposed to be an easy step as well. Where can I get my own? Let's click on that again. Uh, elite maybe? Nah, I'm really being stupid here. Uh, fuck it, no, alright, cool. Let me uh, search this up again. That is why I couldn't get a free clue scroll because I've already done it probably when I was doing a clue scroll grind from before. But yeah, as you can see, that is the clued up achievement task there. So yeah, make our way back to the spreadsheet once again. Complete our task and... Hey, what's going on there? Heads up, you need to complete 10 more passive tasks to progress. Really? I think it's getting it mixed up. Mm, yeah, something dodgy's gone on there. Alright, cool. Let me quickly message someone and see if they can sort this out. To me, that's wrong because I'm, I'm pretty sure that means you need 10 more passives in easy tier to get to medium. So, yeah, I think it's bugged out a little bit there. But let's. I'm just going to quickly do the 10 passives. So let's quickly check what we can actually do passives we should have a few of these done actually but yeah we'll go through them all and i'll see how many i've done already and see if that can push us through into the uh, easy tier again yeah i'll be back with you in a minute 
this should be the last um, passive that we should be able to complete till we get a new task. So yeah, let's construct the tier 3 storehouse and Anachronia, which we've already done previously. But yeah, that was nice and simple. I didn't have to do anything that I didn't previously do in uh, other videos. So yeah, let's go back to the dashboard now. Generate our new task, which is going to be obtain the, the Karos Clue Carrier. Can be obtained after completion of the Desperate Times quest. Even if you, all right, cool. Let's go do some questing. This should be the end of URA complete. So let's quickly talk to Yuri right now. And that should be quest complete. So yeah. Uh, um, not task complete, quest complete. We got... I don't know if I can actually open that or not. Uh, so it gave us a bunch of clue scrolls. Would we actually need that? I don't... So we can't... Wait, 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 wait. So if I actually do that, do I get a... Clue scroll or what? Mm, yeah, I don't have a clue, but yeah, let's go do Desperate Times right now. This should be the end of Desperate Times coming up. So let's quickly just talk to Seren right now to finish this up. There it is, all done. Let's use our lamp. That's our lamp there. Use it on Herblo, I'm guessing. Any levels? None, but yeah, that is task complete. As you can see, we've got our Karos Clue Carrier. And yeah, let's make our way back to the spreadsheet once again and complete our task. And what do we get next? Obtain a unique from the statues of statues of the Bandos throne room. Access to the room requires completion of the chosen commander, which I don't think we've done. Alright, cool. What can we actually get? Granite mace and superior inch. Alright, cool. Let's go do some PVM. There we have the Chosen Commander complete. Do we get any levels? Oh, nice 60 agility. Nice little level coming in there. Do we unlock anything? Uh, the Werewolf course. Oh, a Livid Farm. Maybe that's, a, I think that's a task in the future, so that would be good, and yeah. Cool, so now we can go kill the statues and get one of the maces. So yeah, let's get into that now. Finally, 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 we get the Granite Mace. I don't actually know how many we killed of these because yeah it's been a while we nearly actually hit 80 hp as well but yeah there we have the granite mace and that is task complete so let's make our way to the spreadsheet uh i don't know the kc but we got the granite mace and let's complete our task uh what do we get next register a total of so i guess we're gonna have to go get another um, blah, 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 defender. So yeah, let's go get the Iron Defender. There we have the Iron Defender coming in. Let's quickly pick that up and get out of this room. And yeah, that is now task complete. So we got that after, after, after 136 kills. I don't know if that's good or bad, but yeah, it didn't take us too long. So yeah, let's make our way to the spreadsheet once again. 136 kills and let's highlight the iron defender there we go let's complete our task and what do we get next register a total of four unique items in the Mauritania section so what can we actually so black boots dark mystic hat rogue bottom uh yeah if i don't have one of these already should we go for the black boots maybe all right, cool. I'll quickly check if we have any of these and I'll be back with you with the either task, task being completed or we'll be getting a drop. Quickly just checked in the bank and as you can see in a previous grand, we've obviously got the black boots before. So back to the spreadsheet once again. Let's complete the black boots. Complete and what is our next task? Register a total of two calling hand corpses in the Mauritania section of your Slayer collection log. So I'm guessing we've got to get one hand is needed for your player and house. All right, cool. So we've got to get two calling hands. There we have the calling hand on the floor. 
And as you can see, we had it got it in 220 kills, which is a one in five one two drop. So yeah, we got a little bit spooned on that. And yeah, so now we've got two calling hands and that is task complete. So let's make our way back to the spreadsheet once again. What did I say it was? Two, 220. And yeah, let's complete our task and see what we get next. Which is explore a tomb the slow way. Complete a solo game of shifting tombs without using any of the movement abilities, surge, escape, or bladed dive. All right, cool. Nice and easy. This should be the task coming in now. So let's quickly wait for this to just teleport out. And yeah, there we go. Is that the achievement that I need? Wait, let me quickly double check that. It's not called surge in tombs. Let's go into our achievements. Uh, activities, where's mini games? Uh, there it is. So, what is it called? It's not called Surgeon Tombs. Wait, what? Complete all objectives solo in Shifting Tombs without using Surge. Oh, okay. So, I actually have to complete it. All right, cool. So, let me go back into another Shifting Tombs. I call it game. And yeah, I'll be back with the challenge in a minute. Once we got this rope. This should be task complete now, so let's wait for the um, achievement to pop up. There we go. It's not called Surging Tombs. So yeah, once you've got the hangout, I've never actually done Shifting Tombs before, but yeah. Oh, nice little level there as well. Yeah, like I was saying, I've never actually done Shifting Tombs before, but yeah, once you get the hang of it, it's quite easy. But yeah, that is task complete. So let's make our way back to the spreadsheet once again and complete our task and see what we get next. With Register a total of 12 unique items in the Fremenic province. So let's quickly check what we can actually get. So, Tour of Boots, Leaf Bladed Sword. Ah, let me quickly go because I know we actually have Eva or one of them. Let me, I'm just teleporting to a bank now. There we go. Let me quickly search Leaf Bladed. You can't actually see this, but we've got. Offhand leaf bladed sword, we've got leaf bladed sword, and we've got leaf bladed spear. So let's just tick that one off there. Complete our task. Generate something new, which is obtain a unique from Wolf. I remember staying here for a long time to get bladed dive. So yeah, what can we actually get? We might actually get a small one this time. So yeah, I'm gonna see how much anima is. Is it anima? Is that the currency there, anima? Yeah, we're going to see how much anima it takes and get this one out of the way nice and quick. And that's where we're going to call episode 41. So yeah, it does feel good to be back filming. But before we end this video off, let's go do our little checks that we do at the end of the episode. So yeah, we started this one off on, what was it, 51% easy. So 3% plus a couple beginner, um, couple beginner challenges. And I think I ticked off a few passives. I've already done previously and we started this one off where was it nine ninety ninety first, and we're up to 89 so that's not really great on the places but yeah it is what it is and hopefully we get more in the next episode so yeah if you did enjoy episode 41 please leave a like it does help me out a lot and subscribe for more taskman videos